Ooh, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to Zachary X. How are y'all doing today? So, in front of me, I have Craig of the Creek. This episode, season four, The Cursed Word. I don't even want to read the synopsis of this because I feel like I know where this might go. Ooh, that does not mean I am not going to feel uh, a little bit scared for Craig. <laughs> so, in the last episode, uh, we had the cowboy and Marie. Uh, the one horse girl who was just not really into being horses she it kind it kind of it kind of i guess she did have fun at first but then mackenzie yes that was her but mackenzie kind of just took a lot of the fun out of doing it uh, and like she more or less she wanted to break away honestly again i was kind of i've kind of mentioned this before i think but i i kind of expected her to like break away from them entirely maybe maybe try and start her own sports group maybe her and toman trying to play sports all that because she just wants to play horse and who would want to play horse besides Toman. I'm just saying. Then again, Toman is a lot. AKA extra. AKA so, so much. AKA can't slow down. AKA I'm done. I'm, I'm done. Sorry. <laughs> but yeah, this one's going to be interesting. Um, yeah, let's see where this goes. Here we go. It's Craig of the Creek. He's going to say that. He's Craig of the Creek, he's gonna sit down He's Craig of the Creek The cursed word, who? Good thing I got my map, so I can never get lost Oh crap, <gasps> not the map! Okay, okay, please, please be okay Phew, you, my good friend, are going Yep Don't say clonk Clonk? Clonk Clonk Long. You said it four times Ooh, already. Work. What is this? Come on, Mortimer. You can do it. What's your name? He's not a parrot. He's not a parrot. You... Your name is... Kelsey. Mortimer's not a parrot. Wait, I almost did it. Mortimer, what's your name? Oh, man. Guys, I'm My bad. Word, clonk. What did you say? Whoa. So, check this. I was taking a long shortcut, right? But then I saw the tree, and it had some words carved on it. Don't say clonk. Clonk. Clonkwe. Clonkwe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's the cleansing dance. Everyone knows you gotta do a cleansing after saying a cursed word. <gasps> did I say a curse word? Don't tell my mom. Wait. <laughs> no. A curse ed word. Oh. Word. Wait, so wait. Okay. Fuck, I, I almost said it. Shit. <laughs> How many times did you say it, Craig? Uh, I said clonk when I read the tree that said, do not say Stop clonk. Stop saying it! And then I said clonk a couple more times, because it's such a weird word, right? Clonk? You're all like 13 clonk. now, 14. Uh, and I said clonk a bunch of times 15. just now, so... Oh, for the love of Scrooge Craig, stop saying that word! You're probably already released! The curse. What the fuck is the I curse? Know, Wait, I don't get it. The word is cursed? Yes, and anyone who says it will get, you know... Hey, Craig! Wait, what happens? Well, nobody knows what happens, but we don't say it because we don't want to find out! You're what? afraid to say a word, but you don't know why. And you've never seen anything bad happen to anyone who said it? Yeah, exactly. Makes perfect sense to me. This is how urban mysteries are started. The King's Kitchen is no more. We serve every taste bud in the creek. That is now, so let me awesome, tell you yes. About my favorite trip chips with beaver dust. All of our chips are locally sourced from back really? to table. So okay. so um, you just poured them on the okay. The dry ramen squares with the flavor packets on the side. What? Excellent choice. I'll have a creek boba with extra marshmallows. Great! And for you, Craig? Oh. Yes, I would like a deconstructed chocolate roll with blackberry jam. Will that be for the table? Um uh Tables? Oh, oh really? Yo, oh, Thank you very much. oh, y'all going Dutch Guys, now. I told okay. you I'm not cursed. We aren't gonna risk it, Craig! Not before we eat! Jeez. What are you about Excuse to- Excuse me, Tien, one more thing. Do you have any clunk? Why? Uh, but we don't have that in stock. You Craig, see, are you about really to- Are you about to fuck clunk. around with people? That's not right. Oh, is that some clunk over there? No clunk in here. I thought you had headphones in, bruh. Freshly baked clonk. <laughs> so it's just boom, boom. The soup could use some more clonk. Why? <laughs> Honestly, I don't blame him, I but. I can you that this clonk stuff is made up. I can say clonk all day. Nothing will happen to me. Clonk, clonk, clonk. Craig. Why is she don't talking? joke about things you don't understand. Get your just desserts. 
She literally just told you fuck around and find out. Oh no. What the clonk does that even mean? Honk, clonk! What did you say? I said honk, honk. Get out of the way, man. Wait, why are you... Anyway. It's just a word. I mean, nothing bad is gonna happen to me if I say clonk. Look, that's what you get for not paying attention. Okay. Okay, what's the pick for movie night, kids? The Small Uncle Movie! Hey, nope. Watch this time, I'm gonna do the voices. Maybe Bernard's right, hon. Why don't we watch a different clock? Mm. Clonk and Furious, Clonk Story 4. Hello? Clonk Story? Oh, waiting to clonk. I'd be a little old for you, clonks. Are, are, are you guys saying clonk? Didn't we warn you? You will get your justice hurts. What the fuck is happening? Nope, uh-uh, nope, stop, mm -mm. nope, 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 mm -mm. Mm -mm. nope, I'm out now, uh, forget it. <laughs> Damn it, Craig, why did you have to fuck around? Why did you have to fuck around? Now you're about to find out, man, jeez. <laughs> okay, it was a nightmare. Paranormal. Phrasing. Shut up! I come seeking your guidance. I've done something bad. I mess with forces I don't understand. I said a cursed word. What's the big deal? I say them all the time. No, Which no, no, okay, no, not a curse word. A okay. C L O N Q U E clonk. <laughs> oh, that, that, wow, that takes me back. Relax. <laughs> <clears throat> what in the Witch world? Middle school. There was a summer jam that was so contagious it spread across the world, melting the minds of any boys who heard its malevolent melody. It's the song that got what? real big a long time ago. What the? Baby, you're my everything. The reason I was born to sing. And when you shut the door on me. One hour later. <laughs> two hours later. <laughs> three hours later. Can you move it along? I'm all out of time cards. Ooh, okay. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Jesus. When it was going down, I took a look around. Everyone in town heard the sound. I hit rock right bottom with a claw. Rock right bottom with a claw. Rock right bottom with a claw. Wait, wait, it was, it's a fucking dance? Are you kidding me? Anyway, they played it everywhere and it got like totally annoying. Yeah, after that summer, nobody wanted to ever hear the word clomp ever again. Ten I couldn't years tell ago. Everyone. Thanks, witches. <laughs> How do I still remember this? Ugh, maybe it is cursed. Hear ye, <sighs> hear ye. I come bearing good tidings. Craig, what tidings. are you doing? <laughs> uh, I did not know that. Anyway, I have something important to share. This cursed word isn't a cursed word at all. Uh, someone stop him before he curses us all. Guys, just, just ch chill for a second. Chill for a second. Look familiar? It's the cleansing dance. Ah, uh, I kind of like this. With a call, 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 with a call. <laughs> See? It's just a song. Oh I, my I don't god. Get it. I think it's like sad or something. <laughs> that that falsetto, I see. I this hit some notes. Everywhere. And everybody got sick of it, but nobody got hurt. So we can stop living in fear. Okay, well. Now, all together, just throw your worries aside and say it with me. Clock! Kitchen is a clock. Ooh. Well, shit. <laughs> this took me back to high school, and I'm not in a good way. <laughs> See, you know, you know, I had a thought process during all this. I'll I'll get to it in a second. Give me a second. Give me a second. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I just, I just, I just, I just, I just, oh, wow, okay, so, 
So Craig is out here and he's just um, trying to make his way back to the stump with his map and then suddenly it just gets blown out of his hands and starts flying and it flies into this tree with this on the... Someone carved Don't Say Clonk into a tree with snakes and skulls. If you come across that and you're a kid and you see that, of course you're going to think it's bad because skulls, snakes, vaguely demonic lettering. <laughs> Someone really hated the song, and I, I don't blame, I don't blame him. I'm trying to think, what song would that, would that be? Like, I'm trying to think back to when I was in high school. What exactly would that song have been? But then again, this is such a generational thing, honestly. Like, for every decade, there's at least five certain songs that people just constantly played, constantly remembered. Off the top of my head, not even trying to define the decades. It's basically anything else played at a middle school dance. Like, this is how we do it. Cupid Shuffle. What else? What else? Um, I remember when I was in fifth grade. I remember, I remember I was on the playground and some kids were walking up to recess with their teacher and they were singing Fresh As I'm Is by Bow Wow. <laughs> like, like, imagine just standing on, standing on a blacktop and just, just, just like a few just like a few yards away. Yeah, right, yeah, right, yeah, bumping like I'm bumping, yeah, saying nothing, homie, yeah, fresh as I'm is. Like, <laughs> let's see, when I was in high school, there, high school, fucking, geez, this, during high school, it was, this was the days of Vine for me. I'm so glad that damn app died, but it did so much damage. <laughs> Don't drop that dun da da. My niggas by YG. Shmoney. Fucking, uh, what was it? What was it? Teach me how to duggy. Fucking middle school was Crank That Soldier Boy. Damn, all those damn Crank That songs that are just still all over YouTube today. <laughs> so ridiculous and dumb, and <laughs> you, you just can't help but look back and laugh. So, Craig says this about like four times and when he gets back to the stump like tries to tell tries to tell these guys about like what he found on a tree and they just freeze up and tense up because like it's a cursed word at least that's what they think because they saw the damn tree they saw the skulls and they saw the snakes and then the two of them do this do this weird ass dance <laughs> Did I say a curse word? Don't tell my mom. See, 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 where Craig was, that's where I thought this was going. But then again, I forgot. Yeah, no, this show, this show is actually, actually very good at exploring a lot of different lessons. And obviously, and obviously like, certain kids are better than others about cursing, cursing. Craig's parents seem like the type of parents that would, that would try their best not to curse in front of Craig. So, like, so they, these two, they're getting onto him because they're just like, stop saying that word. Don't say that word. That word is cursed, even though they have no idea why it's cursed. Nobody knows why it's cursed exactly. Just to make things even worse, after they get here, they go back to the chef's kitchen, which, hold on, real quick, can we see that opening shot from the kitchen again, though? Like, like, look, the kitchen is up and running and back in action again. I'm, I'm happy to see that we got to see this. <laughs> so the elder's just up here in a tree, and then got TM, he's being the waiter. But he's over here, one's washing, one's making the peanut butter, of course. Got all the bake ovens over here. Again, how are they getting power, exactly? Like, th does, one of their, does one of their parents have just, like, an electric generator they don't use? or what what's up but anyway uh so tm <laughs> again look at the flag but anyway like after they get here they're literally sitting at separate tables because these two are so afraid of getting cursed honestly i get craig's frustration here nobody can actually give him a straight answer about what about what exactly happens when this word is said like literally i'm just thinking about the i'm just thinking about the theater myth of this word and <laughs> i mean wait does it count if i've just if i if i no, I, I feel like I have to say it out loud. S says it to TM, and TM drops the food. Drop the food, man. That is a cardinal sin as a chef. And he really just goes around the place and starts starts saying clonk to everybody. Just to fuck with everybody. Again, I, I really don't blame him. I really don't. But then suddenly, the elder kid shows up and is like, Boy, you mess with voices you don't understand. She literally just tells him, You keep fucking around, you're gonna find out. And he eventually does find out. He, he eventually does find out after having a bad nightmare about everybody saying, about everybody constantly saying the word clunk. So after all the clunk parodies, suddenly this happens. <laughs> The Sith, his mom, his brother, his sister does a, does the fucking poltergeist, pull some poltergeist shit, and well, Craig is really Craig is really starting to realize, starting to think like, wow, the force, I really have messed with forces that I don't understand. Of course, he's a kid, and like a lot of things are just 
it's all over the screen. A lot of bad things are happening right now, but like, it was all a nightmare. It's all good. It was all good. Also, I love the fact that he keeps this tarot card just above his bed the entire time. I do love that, little details like that. So Craig goes back over here to the Witches of the Creek. He's running here because he wants to, he's, he's trying to see like if the two of them can like help him with this curse that he that he has in that he's done and <laughs> when at first when they say this cursed word what's the big deal i say them all the time <laughs> okay i like i like the fact that even teenage characters act like teenagers even bernard he tries to act more mature than he is but the reality is he wants to be seen as mature he want i remember recently i was watching the the lockdown episode and how often he he never is trying to be responsible he's always talking about i'm gonna look responsible as long as i look responsible he's not trying to actually be responsible <laughs> which is such a teenager thing and i kind of love it i mean it's true <laughs> Bro, that was the most real reaction. That was the most real reaction I think I've ever seen in this show. Cause damn, like you, we all know that feeling when we when we like hear about something or or someone just references something that we just haven't haven't seen in so long, and it's just like damn. When was the last time I thought about this? <laughs> this is why I love this show. It always it always it always brings me back back to like different points in life, but all, while giving good life advice for the future, it always just it always gives it always flashes you back to like certain little memories you had in middle school. Cause like look at the look on her face. The freaking freaking the freaking eyeline underneath it's just like damn it's like whoa i just i just got taken back to middle school what the heck it's like oh my basically this this the 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 where this word stems from clunk this 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 very generic r&b me this this Bruh. They say as they're like the muscle memory literally just came back and they started dancing and everything. It's just like god damn. This show gets so real sometimes. Like it, it's almost disturbing and I love it. Oh my god. Oh my god. You know what this you know what this you know actually you know what this really reminds me of? How many people remember the Harlem Shake? Yeah, I feel like I triggered triggered a lot of memories for people as soon as I said that. Oh man. Oh man. Bruh, this is this is Jesus Christ! <laughs> I, 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 oh. oh my God! I, I just can't with. Wow. Like no other show sends me on this much of a fucking roller coaster of emotion in this much of a mixed bag like Crack of the Creek does. It's, it's God dang. So, so now Craig is armed with this knowledge. How do I still remember this? Ugh, maybe it is cursed. Honestly, I get that feeling. I get that feeling. Anyway, Craig, he gets back over here. He's he gathered up everybody that he said clock to, including including the kid on the bike. And I don't know who this one this one is. They're probably just they're probably just here. But anyway, Craig is basically here to tell them like, no, this isn't a cursed word. Just look at this look at this embarrassing ass video real quick. Like seriously, like seriously, hit rock. Bottom with a clunk, run bottom with a clunk, a clunk, clunk. Please chill, Elder. Anyway, it was never a cursed word. Now everybody's, now everybody is feels slightly embarrassed. Honestly, I don't blame them. I don't blame them. <laughs> Jesus Christ, this is, this is, this is so cut. <laughs> This this might this might be probably the best episode of the season. Oh my god! Uh, again, I th I think uh, I, when this conversation with the explanation was going, I just think back to middle school and I think back to high school. I think back to, I think back to like just ten years ago I was in high school and I think back to like the, like all those all those dumbass songs, especially the ones that were taken over by Brian. Oh, suit and tie. There's another one. Um, fucking drunken love by Beyonce. There it is. <laughs> God, oh my god. I'm, I'm, I'm done. I need to get away from this. Comment down below. Tell me what you think. Don't forget to like, subscribe. I'll repeat the bell for whenever I upload new videos. I, I need to start saying all these outro things again and doing better, but it's like, Jesus. Wow. I, I'll talk to all you later. Um, yeah. Goodbye. <laughs>
head. Oh my god. Clonk? Clonk hair. Clonk? Clonk? Even a clonk. 